some of the food is even better than a lot of Melbourne brunch places, not gonna lie. Oh! Whoa, look at that one, that's even bigger. Oh my God, that looks so good. <laughs> Hey guys, it's Tina from Hangry Bar Nature. We are in Ballarat and we're gonna show you some of the really cool hidden gems that you probably didn't know about. Make sure you subscribe before we start and let's get straight into it. Mount Buninyong. Now to get the best views of the whole region, Mount Buninyong is where you need to go. What's even more mind blowing, it's an extinct volcano. All right, the journey begins guys. Uh I'm tired already. <laughs> There's a memorial lookout which is two stories high and gives you a view that is higher than the trees that surround you. Yeah, we made it! Yeah, we made it to the top when I swear, guys. It's amazing how far you can see from the tower and it's hands down one of the best sunsets we have seen. Hydrant Food Hall has cool vibes where you're in a hipster warehouse that serves amazing food. <clears throat> Look, I'm just gonna put it out there, but some of the food is even better than a lot of Melbourne brunch places, not gonna lie. Oh man, it's so <laughs> yummy. Check out their twist on the Eggs Benedict with pulled pork on waffles. Even their smashed avo on toast is really good. Oh, that is so refreshing. And the kiddos really enjoyed the rainbow pancakes, warning they will get a sugar high. So beware, parents. Okay, you gotta be patient, Flo. I'm playing golf. That's cool, you just hold on to it for me. Oh! Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> I cannot believe I caught a fish. Oh! Yeah! Tookie Trout Farm is an unforgettable experience where you can actually catch what you eat. That's so good. That is so, so fresh. Oh my gosh. This is so amazing, guys. Like, it gives you so much more of appreciation for food because catching your own food is not easy, but so worth it at the end. Even if you don't catch a trout, they've actually got fresh ones out in the back, which they can cook for you if you don't catch one. The warm hospitality of owners Robert and Jan made it even more special. Oh yeah, and there's also accommodation for a quiet getaway, which they made themselves using materials from the huge property, like these stones. The farm is a little bit further out from Ballarat, but definitely worth the drive out. Ballarat Botanic Gardens. You can find the Ballarat Botanic Gardens on the western side of Lake Windurie. It spans over 40 hectares. It's a beautiful casual place to visit for a stroll and the gardens are kept really well. Some of the main features are the unique conifer trees. Holy moly guys, look at this tree. It is huge and it actually looks ancient. Whoa, look at that one, that's even bigger. Holy moly, that's a big tree. Wow, that's amazing. What's it feel like? It actually feels like you're patting like a dog's ear. <laughs> yeah, it does yeah. actually. Wow. Oh my God, it's like a dog's ear. Beautiful garden beds, Italian marble statues, and sculptures of Australia's previous prime ministers. Ballarat Wildlife Park. I don't think I've ever really seen so many free roaming kangaroos and wallabies, guys. This is the place to come to see Australian wildlife. Rafi, why are you stealing my wife? Holding your hand, Raph. <laughs> That's cute. Are you guys alpacas? Oh. Mm. Mm. Oh, Look at Flo, the good Samaritan, feeding all the kangaroos where he can. <laughs> oh. oh no. He feels self-conscious now because like we're watching him eat. <laughs> Still going. Ballarat Wildlife Park also has other international wildlife such as meerkats, tortoises, reptiles, and their latest addition, the Sumatran tiger. Oh guys, check that out. I'm gonna let it out. This is definitely a great gem for the whole family with so many exciting sights. Fun fact guys, in Australia there are more kangaroos than there are people. Let that sink in. Brown Hill Fish and Chips. You gotta get your hands on Brown Hill Fish and Chips, deep fried Mars bar, Snickers, Tim Tams and Cherry Ripes. Wow, it tastes like a Tim Tam potato cake, literally. That's what I can think of, a sweet, chocolatey, Tim Tam potato cake. That's what it is. Oh my god. Oh, that is so good. That is, that is diabetes in a batter, but oh my god, so good. Lake Wenduri is a very scenic and great outdoor place to visit. It's really beautiful to walk around, especially as the sun starts to set.
make sure to check out the huge adventure playground and wildlife around the lake. If you're looking for a family-friendly place to stay, we highly recommend Lake Windjuri Luxury Apartments. Hey, let's go take a look. Whoa! It's so spacious. It's huge. It's actually really big. I know. I love the open space living room. Check out the kitchen. That is so nice. Wow, it's like so modern. Come here. Come here. The bathroom. Oh, the bathroom. Oh, Hi, Rafi. Oh, move! This is your room. How have you guys already claimed the room? How? Because we have a TV. Oh, because we have a TV. Because <laughs> you have a TV. Oh, we have a TV too. Oh, we have a bathroom. We will take this one. Newly renovated too. Hello there. Oh, how many TVs? Three. Three. And look, on we have a tablet in this room too. Yeah, that's like the Ballarat guys. Oh, and then I see. We've got Netflix on here, which I'm. Um, Assuming we can stream to the TV, yeah. obviously. Cool. Mommy. Netflix night. I'm just show you something. Oh, Ooh. fireplace. Yes, fireplace. Guys, it's also steps away from Lake Winduri. You can pretty much see the lake from the living room and the bedroom. And that's <laughs> the end of our apartment tour. The forge was named after the grandfather's trade as a blacksmith. Place delivers some of the most mouth-watering wood-fired pizza with locally sourced ingredients. Oh my god, that looks so good. They've been a hit in Ballarat since 2010 and we totally understand why. I mean, just check out these pizzas. The lamb is so tender. It's like just the perfect combination. Another great brunch place in Ballarat is Webster's Market and Cafe. Using locally sourced ingredients, of course, they have fresh and scrumptious brunch food and awesome coffee. Also, make sure to get on the app to get $5 off for new users. And those were all the hidden gems we came across in Ballarat. We hope it inspired you to come and visit Ballarat to check out these cool, cool places. Before we knock off, make sure you guys subscribe to the channel and hit the like button. Until then, we'll see you in the next video. Peace!